Hello everyone, so today we will install the VMware ESXi in the VMware workstation. So I click on the create new virtual machine and click next. And then I have the ISO file, I can browse, this is my file, VMware installer here. Open it and click next. You can name your machine, yeah. so I just keep it default. And this is the location, so I will browse to store in D drive, my D drive. Oh, sorry, my E drive, yes, D, D is my recovery. And I will install in VMware folder. And I keep I store it here in this folder. Click OK and then click Next. And for the hard disk, we'll add 100, yep, 100 gig. And click Next. Summary of yep, the VMware and the location and the version. And then click Finish. Our control and enter to make it bigger. And click enter to continue. Click enter to continue. This is the keyboard layout, so the US in the default. I accept this one and I click enter to continue. In here, we have to set the password. The default user is root, and I will put my password. And click type, confirm the password, and click enter to continue. And now the installation is successfully, so click enter to reboot. Okay, so now the VMware ESXi 6.7 is start up and you can see it here and you can see here if you click F2 on your keyboard it will customize the system and if you want to start down you can click F12 so in here the IP address is get from the ACP so I will set it to manual so to customize your ESXi you can click on F2 yeah. And you can arrow key down, configure management network, yes, and you click in. And then this is the network adapter, and in here, IPv4 configuration, you click in. And in here, you can see this ball, IPv4, or use dynamic or use static, and here, yes, so I will use the static. I click space to select it, and then I want to use my IP address range this is my IP address ring and click enter if you see the gateway is not uh, in the range so if we change the gateway I click enter and we change the gateway to our gateway the full gateway yes. Uh, number two thank you for your watching <laughs>